So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. The teams then, Real Madrid against Barcelona. My name's Peter Drury and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. Well, this is intense. They talk about it for months, they remember it for years. It matters almost too much when Barca and Real collide. Real Madrid, Keylor Navas, keeps goal, Pepe, Sergio Ramos, Daniel Carvajal, Marcelo, Casemiro, Modric, Tony Kroos, Bale, Cristiano Ronaldo, Benzema, tasked with leading the line, Barcelona, Ter Stegen, takes the gloves, Pique, Mascherano, Daniel Alves, Jordi Alba, Sergio Busquets, Rakitic, Iniesta, Messi, Neymar, Luis Suarez, tasked with scoring goals. There's the whistle, and here we go. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? It's hard to overlook Gerard Piquet. He should be given a bit more credit, I think, for his performances. Anticipates well, composed on the ball, and, and pretty good in the air. That'll all be needed for what's to come here, too. Yeah, I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. It's Carla Hall. Massive leap! Loose ball, who's going to get that? And he's there to hoof it away. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. Piquet. It's a loose ball. And he's on his way! Madrid and Real Madrid are ahead perfect placement the one place the keeper couldn't reach well I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out never mind one there was real venom in the strike and and clear composure from the placement Real Madrid. Luis Suarez out wide to the right. Played out to the right. Looks to slip it through. Oh, it's there! They have done it! They have their equaliser! And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Played into the middle. Good delivery, but no joy. Yeah, and he probably didn't get the cleanest of contacts there either. You know, I think he went for too much power with his header. It so nearly came off for him. Well, he went at it with great confidence and it's not going to stop him from trying again.
Aimed long and direct. Aimed forward. And it's Luis Suarez. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert to the danger. Daniel Alves tries a long pass towards the front. It's come loose. Marcelo pumps it upfield. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Modric. Bale. Bale's cross. And back out it comes. Bale looking to get on the end of this. Now it's Tony Cruz. He can get that clear. Who's going to make this theirs? Sergio Busquets. Tries a through ball. It's hit the upright. Oh, good effort. He got plenty on that. Cristiano Ronaldo. He put on quite a show there. He's been a joy to watch, and, and that didn't miss by much. He'll be back. Sergio Busquets does well to read it and intercepts. Fence has got rid of that. Oh, it's beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Rakitic. Can he find a finish now? Rakitic decides to play it back. That carried quite a threat. Looks like a good ball through. Cristiano Ronaldo unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Now the pass. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Clears it out of harm's way. Whipped in. Diving header! What a wonderful goal! Spectacular header. He really flung himself at that. Our oh, strikers love a diving header and he timed that to perfection. Real Madrid. Look, he's the one everyone expects to put the ball in the net. That's what he's paid to do. And it's Iniesta. Played out to the wing. Luis Suarez plays it backwards and they'll try again. And the first 45 minutes are up. Well, we've had plenty to go at in that first half, Peter, and it's a, a fragile lead that could quite easily change hands in, in the second. Uh, if you like your football unpredictable, I think you're at the right match. Real Madrid. And the action is back on the way. Messi. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Well read, he sorted that out. Sergio Busquets, Benzema with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Benzema passes it through. Cristiano Ronaldo with the ball through. Coaxed out to the wing. Decent ball. It 
was all about the quality of the delivery and they come away with nothing good clearance and very necessary Neymar plays a clever pass. Going for goal! It's in! Unbelievable. Oh, a goal of real quality. He made it look ridiculously easy. Look, volleys can be worked on and improvements can be made, but in the moment, it takes timing and balance to catch the perfect spot on the ball to produce brilliance like that. That is absolutely magnificent. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Quite a thriller this one's become. Yeah, it's a very good contest with two very good sides and with such great individual talent on show, it could go either way. That's gone a long way up and away. And it's Modric. Looking to shoot! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. Keylor Navas gets it upfield. Into the channel. Marcelo could try cutting inside here. Out of play for a goal kick. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Jordi Alba. Gets it into the middle. And it's Bale. It's a long forward pass. Now it's Benzema. Thrust towards the front line. Busquets. Jordi Alba gets into the right position to intercept. And it's Luis Suarez. Good defending there. They've slammed the door in the faces of the opposition. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. Jordi Alba. Mascherano. Keeper's got good distance on that. Looks like a good ball through. Benzema pushes it out wide. Shakes the shoots. Goal! Real Madrid! And they get themselves in front! And that is a fabulous Real Madrid goal. Look, a big part of Real's potency is still produced by their ability to hit teams on the counter. In that regard, they have two of the world's very best specimens, Bale and, of course, Ronaldo. Barcelona, I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy.
PK. Tries a through ball. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's there to get rid. Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. I love to see a team closing down from the front like that, and I think they did brilliant to win it back and get the shot away. Modric. Surely he scores! Just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Real Madrid. Messi. There will be four extra minutes. Ter Stegen gets it upfield. Rakitic passes it through. Messi. Messi's cross. There is the final whistle. Real Madrid. So there it is. What struck you most about that? Real Madrid. That's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.